lowly imps to try and stop you from continuing. Summon you? You have to help me? <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Don't get upset about it! Oh, oh, oh! <sighs> um, maybe I should find another teacher. No! Wait! <laughs> I'm so sorry. He has no brain. That's why I had to take over. Hey, knock it off, turnip head! The moon's not even out right now. I don't know why he has to act like such a clown. <laughs> oh, don't cry. I'm sorry I hurt your feelings. You can howl later. This is the kind of thing I have to put up with. You should hope it never happens to you. So, is there any way you can help us go down the river? I'll help you if you get me another barrel of juju candy. I keep them hidden in that cave up there. Where's this cave, exactly? See that secondary section of Silverstone, just next to the sunny side of the southern facade? Silverstone, southern facade, got it. I'll be right back. Thanks for the stash of three. Open it. Empty it on the ground. Okay. Now, what about some help getting down the river? First, give me a lollipop. Not him! Me! Oh yeah, yummy. Now give me a chocolate munch crunch bar. Oh yeah! Greetings, weary travelers. There is no longer any reason to fear. I have brought to you the awesome power of the sacred sandals. Only they don't seem to work so well. Marshmallow Supreme, and a nutty spuddy bar. <laughs> oh, hey. Uh, maybe you two want some alone time, because for what you're doing, it's freaking the lock. No, we don't want any alone time. What we want is a boat. I'm not feeding you any more candy. You promised us a way down the river. I want it now. No problem. <laughs> Hey, Tack! Come back here! Why don't you feed me another lollipop? Because you're disgusting. Grape! Creamy center! Yeah, yeah but, well... Grape creamy center? No problem. Oh. Help me! Oh. Oh. I'm going in. Hey, you! I know, you don't know how to thank me. That's okay. I'm glad you're free, and I really hope that... Oh, I do know how to thank you. You do? I do. You know, you smell funny. Actually, I stink. 
Pins and needles? What is this, Dream Juju? Tag. Remember when I told you that you would learn something about yourself? Yeah? Well, what you just learned is... You're an idiot! Tlaylock! In the flesh! I used you, Tag, to defeat the Dream Guardian so I could steal the Staff of Dreams. Pins, needles, the staff. Oh, just get the stick. Not so fast, punks. That's the staff of dreams. Ooh, look at the ugly old prunes. We're in the wrong place, Needles. Tear us away out of this dump. Tack, you've got to get that back. You can't let the Staff of Dreams get into the wrong hands. Why, if those two had evil intentions... Like helping Tlaylock tear open the world of nightmares. No one would be that evil. Don't be naive, Dave. How can I go after them? That rift they opened. It led to the shrine of the Pachyderm Noggin, which, so legend has it, is guarded by the giant misunderstanding. A giant? A real giant? Yes, they say he is very powerful. Which reminds me, since the power is on, you can use the banister to follow them. I've set the destination. Good luck. Oh, and don't forget to duck! Those power parasites are the worst. I set traps for them, but their queen had a bigger brain this year and sicked her grubs on me. It was terrible. Uh, thank you. Uh, uh... Tack. Tack, I'm JB, Jabulba's brother. Huh, that's funny. What's funny? Well, your name, JB. And you're Jabulba's brother. It's his same initials. That's not funny. That is my name, Jabulba's brother. Mother didn't even bother to think of a name for me. Oh, can it, JB? Mom was very busy. Dad was off fighting those wars with the Black Mist, lost all of his fingers. Tech, go and turn on the power. I would have been happy with Dave. Brother Jabulba told me about your dream. It's strange, I've never heard about such a princess or of any dream juju. I thought you were an expert in the world of dreams, JB. Well, at least I'm not a mommy's boy with a fancy name. Please, keep focused on the problem and I'll call you whatever you like. Dave? Tack, sit down in the sleep seat. This device will allow us to monitor your progress in the dream world. Perhaps we can find out about this dream juju and learn more about this mysterious princess. Well, I just took a nap. I don't think I could fall asleep again. Maybe in a few hours after a warm glass of milk you and... just need to relax. 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 Sleep. Now! Seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, I bet you can't tell what I'm thinking now. <sighs> You're thinking, why am I pole vaulting when I've never done this before? Hmm? And now you're thinking. <laughs> it is a long way to the bottom. <laughs> 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 Tack, we must cross that bridge. We have to wait for a break in the woodies. Hold on there, not so fast. You won't get away that easily, woodies. Ugh. Now, with your only means of escape destroyed, you have no choice but to deal with the warrior lock. Oh, hey! Not so fast. Whoa! Oh! Go easy on the lock. Oh. Lock will be okay, but how are we gonna get across that chasm? We'll need the help of a juju. won't bother you anymore. Now, help us get out of the swamp. Us? You mean 
It's me, Great Shaman Kaboba. Great Shaman? You look like a blood-sucking freak. Yes, but I am a good. I can take you out of the swamp, no problem. Wait, take me too. Dude, get out of here. Take that all over the lock. Oh, 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 I'll leave you out of the swamp myself. You really know how to party! This staff has opened the way, Tack. The world of nightmares will spill through into our world. All of humankind will fall asleep. So, everybody's asleep, then what? As more and more people fall asleep, the collective dream energy will grow greater and greater and make me, he who wields the staff of dreams, the most powerful being in either the waking or dreaming world. But you only have half of the staff of dreams. Once you stop asking me so many questions, I'll take the other half from you. No, you won't. Yes, I will. No, you won't. Yes, I... Oh, shut up! Who's gonna make me? Me? Oh, yeah? You and what army? Who told you about the army? Fluffy, bring in the girls. Rated everyone! Two fairy godparents. One imaginative kid. Things are about to get... Really odd! <laughs> Parents. Shadow Showdown. Coming soon. Let me go! Your name is Mo? Well, hello, Mo! I'm Tack, not Mo. You're attacking Mo? Now, why on earth would you do that and speak up with that little voice? I have to stop pins and needles. You want a pile of beetles? I need to take back their half of the staff. Half a giraffe? <sighs> Boy, you are weird. Look, it's very simple. Temple? Uh, is Greek okay? No! Look, I just need some help with that rift. Oh, you want to talk to Rick? Rick? I said rift, not Rick. Ask him if he wants to talk to Rick. <sighs> uh... Do you want to talk to Rick? You need help with that rift. Why didn't you say so? Thanks, and so long. A song? Heck yeah, man, I sang your song. Back then my jeans were tighter, my hair was longer. The coffee I drank, it was a whole lot stronger. But I never did nothing, I know it was wronger. Since the day I married you. Bugala bugala fu fu klau tobu kana fali ti bau ku tu 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 or is it li ti pa ka ti? I can never remember that part. Maybe here lo bau ta ti ki bau. No, no, but it's lo bau ta something. <laughs> is this chanting ever going to work? What is it going to take to get into contact with a powerful juju spirit from another world? Ah! It worked! Uh, hello? Can you hear me? You do not speak, but I see that you listen. You look so strange. Your clothes, the power stick you hold in your hand, I have never seen a juju like you before. And what is this magic box you watch me on? It is clearly the most important thing in your hut. You do me great honor to watch me on it. My name is Jabalba. I am the powerful shaman of the great and legendary Pupanuno people. For generations we have... 
Hey! Hey, quiet out there! I'm talking to a juju! Tech, would you shut those people up? This is important! And get Warrior Lock! I want to introduce him to this juju here! I am so sorry, oh strange and powerful juju. There's a lot going on today. That's why I've called upon you for your help. Let me explain. Throughout the history of the Poopanunu people, shaman like myself have known that someday something terrible would happen to our great protector, the Moon Juju. So said the Poopanunu people's prophecy. The Moon Juju is our shield against evil and the source of my Juju power. She is strong and nice and oh, so beautiful. Oh, that's Tlaylock. He's not nice, and he's sure not beautiful. He's jealous and practices bad juju. At the council that chose the new high shaman, he was passed over in favor of me. So last night, Tlaylock decided to take his revenge. Tlaylock crept into the Temple of the Moon with his foul servants, pins and needles, and stole the Moonstones, the source of the Moon Juju's power. The first thing Tlaylock did was to use the Moonstones to change the Pupanunu people into stupid, helpless sheep. Without the Moon Juju, my power was only enough to protect a few. And this is only the beginning of Tlaylock's terrible plan. <laughs> But Tlaylock is a fool. He won't get away with it. For the Poopanunu people's prophecy clearly says a mighty warrior trained by the High Shaman will defeat Tlaylock and save the Moon Juju. I have trained such a warrior. His name is Lock. <coughs> Tech, what are you doing? You told me to go get Lock. Yes, that's right. Go fetch Lock. Stop playing with the sheep. I did get Lock. No, you fetched a dirty, stinky animal. That's Lock. See, he's wearing Lock's amulet. Tlaylock must have changed him into a sheep. No, 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 no! This is all wrong. This isn't in the the poop 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 Oh, this is terrible. Can't we just change him back? I don't know. Yes, I've got it. We can change Locke back into a mighty warrior. This great juju spirit who watches us from another world can help. Follow Tech. Protect him with your power. Go with Tech to the ancient burial ground of our ancestors and put the teeth into the statues. And get me some magical lubu plants while you're out. Now go! Both of you! Lock must stop Tlaylock before he destroys the moon goddess! Hello, Jaboba. I am so glad to be back. Ah, at last, Lock's spirit. Now, we will resurrect him. Hey! Oh! Uh, I, Lock, savior of the Pupanunu people, am alive again. It is so good to be me. Locke, now is the time to fulfill your destiny. Yeah, we're all in terrible danger. We really need you to save us, Locke. All of my training has prepared me for this moment. I am ready, Jabulba, for I am the mighty warrior called for by the Papu. Oh, Papu, Papu. Oh, oh. Oh, oh no. Jaboba, where's the... Out the door, round the back. <laughs> What's wrong with him? <sighs> this always happens when people get resurrected. Whoa. They call it what? Resurrection's Revenge. Whoa. We'll just have Somebody. to be patient. Please. Stay away from him. Turn me off! Ow, ow, wow, yow! <sighs> oh! <sighs> yes. Yes. Oh, that's good. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, goodness. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Heck, oh. there is no more time. You'll have to get the moonstones while Locke recovers. 
Me? <gasps> this magic amulet will help. It increases your abilities when you're at full strength. Oh, it's like lava, baby. All right, I'll go. But try to help Locke. Resurrection's revenge is a terrible thing. Oh, sweet Juju. Tak, the great and mighty warrior of the Pupu Nunu people. He who is lucky enough to have fulfilled the prophecy and defeated the powerful shaman, Tlaylock. What, uh, who are you? What is this place? And can you turn that light down? This is the dream world. You've been here many times before in your dreams, but this time, you have been called here for a purpose. Several days travel from here is a beautiful princess who has been cruelly imprisoned within a dark and terrifying castle. She is held captive by one of the most vicious beasts of the dream world. The god who fills the world-destroying power of the staff of dreams. Sadly, the princess has no rescue from anyone. Except for you, Tak. And if you should save her from her plight, happiness will be restored to her kingdom, and the powers of darkness will be forever diminished. What say you, great and mighty warrior of the Pupu Nunu people? Will you bring your wits, your strength, and your courage to bear on this sacred mission? Nah, don't think so. Uh, no, 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 wait! Hello! You're not supposed to do that. Get back here! <clears throat> Several days travel from here as a beautiful princess who has been cruelly imprisoned within a dark and- I heard you, but the princess thing? Come on, that's the oldest one in the book. People always say that kind of stuff in dreams. What's the point? I'm probably gonna wake up any minute. No, Tag. If you do not accept this challenge, you will never wake up again. Oh, oh, okay. Well then, I'll do it. Good. I promise you. In the fulfillment of this quest, you will learn something new about yourself, Tag. Hmm, something new about myself, huh? Okay, fine. Where's this princess? Not so fast, Tag. You will need training before you can complete this quest. The dream world is new to you. It has many dangers. Right, now then, pay attention. Moon Juju, what are you doing here? I've come to help you, Tak, but we have to hurry. I can only stay a short time in the world of dreams. Here, Tak, choose a spirit animal to enhance your powers. Dragon. Dragon. Eagle. Eagle. Jaguar. Jaguar. Piranha. Piranha. Which one would you pick, Moon Juju? The choice is pretty obvious, Tak. You'd be a fool and a total idiot loser not to choose the... What? The what? Hello? Moon Juju? <sighs> hey, how did you... Aren't you supposed to wait until I put the tiki in? I knew you were going to put the tiki in. I read minds. I foretell the future. Oh, well then you know what I'm going to ask you. How you can cross the chasm, I know, I know. I sense there will be a new bridge. Great! In ten and one half years. What? Oh, it's too late. That doesn't do me any good. I know. You're sad. No, I'm not sad. I just have to... You're afraid of the dark. Uh, no. You're lonely. You feel like a lost little boy. Wrong. You cry when no one's looking. What? And most of all, you miss your mommy. Oh, great buckets of Jojo. He's reading my mind. Oh, yes, you. That is who I meant. You want to cross the chasm. Nearby, in this woodland, are three unusual magic stones. Hmm? Fetch them for me, and I'll show you how they can be used. Don't come back until you have all three stones. Tell me more, oh great Juju. Hmm. First of all, I have to tell you, I can't believe what you did to your puppy. Locke, you must return all of Tuck's stuff you borrowed. What do you mean? What stuff? That's enough. And apologize to all of the girls. It's just joking. 
<sighs> it wasn't easy, but I've got the three stones you wanted. Excellent. Give them to me. There. It's just a little something I picked up on the night shift. What am I supposed to do with these? I sense that you want to know what you're supposed to do with these. Hmm. Well, maybe I could throw them at things. Perhaps you could throw them at things. Hmm, I bet with the right target, I could use them to swing across the chasm. Use these magical bolas to grapple a target and swing across the chasm. Okay. I think this will work. You're welcome. Thank you, great Juju. <sighs> Where'd everybody go? Hey, I'm right here, guy. Where are we going? Well, I'm off to save a princess. Name's Locke. You're like one of the undead, right? You want to tag along? Wow. Could I, your highness? I mean, I've never partied with royals! Let's party on. A Juju Shrine! We're saved! We made it! <laughs> I thought we were goners. Volcanoes, vampire bats, those zombie ninjas of the black mist. We have been through it all. Better wait here, my man. I'll go contact the Juju. No, wait, but I'm a Juju! I can help us find Tech and Jaboba! Cool, cool. But why don't I contact somebody with some real Juju power? Yeah, we need something a little better than a pinata or a punch bowl, my, uh... Party going, compadre. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You're killing me, but you're right. Oh, great Juju. We humbly summon your August Majesty to this sacred place. So that this is we... so exciting. Wow! Hello! We're gonna get a really fantastic Juju! <sighs> I'll be so honored to meet him! Don't interrupt the summoning. You might take him off. Okay, okay. Anyway. The most impressive of the Jujus. We summon you now! You? Hey, it is me! I am the best! I am the greatest! I am so happy to meet me! Let's celebrate! Punch for everybody! JB! JB! Punch me at his laboratory. All work and no play at JB. It's just shamanism, shamanism, shamanism. Hello? Somebody there? Help! I'm trapped! Power parasites! They're everywhere! Come down, JB. It's me, Jaboba. What's going on? They they've stuck me to the wall. I think one of them wants to eat my face. Hold on, JB. We'll be right there. I'll buzz you in. Take the lift. Hurry! Get here as fast as you can. Not now, Needles. We have to get the staff to Tlaylock. Aw, oh, is the little Juju doll scared of me? Needs his mommy pins to protect him? <laughs> Needles, don't listen to him. He's just trying to wind you up. Come on. What's the matter, Needles? Cat got your tongue? Or did somebody sew your mouth shut? Come on, Jaboba. They'll run forever if we can't get them to stand and fight. I don't. Pins is a, a poopy head. Ha! Pacock! 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 Nice one. Okay, let's get it on! But I just defeated you! By defeating me in the real world, you helped me to become a creature of the nightmare world. I have become more than a man with the body of a sheep, Tack. With the power of this stuff, I can become whatever I want to be. What I want to be is your complete and total destruction. Well, duh. I have a staff, too.
your princess pants on? Help! I need some help! No one's helping me! Help! Come on, great and mighty warrior of the Pupununo people's prophecy! <laughs> Show him who's boss! Where am I? Yar, in the Woody's dungeon. This is where they keep their prisoners before the big event. Big event? What's that? You'll see soon enough. Is there any way out of here? Perhaps. Guess what's in the box and I'll give you a key to the lift over there. <sighs> okay, how many guesses do I get? Three? As many as you like. I've got a lot of time on my hands. And I'm bored, so guess away. Great. Is it some extra clothing? No. Is it food? No. Um, maybe some books? No. Boy, this is tough. Don't worry, I'll get it. A goat? No. A baby goat? No. <sighs> A very valuable gold necklace that's sacred to the moon, Juju? Uh, or maybe... Wait, I got it! Inside the box is another box! No. I've got it. There's nothing inside the box. That's it, isn't it? Nothing! Oh, yeah, it's a trick! You tricked me! No. Yes, you did! There's nothing in there! Come on, admit it! No. Prove it. Who you call nothing? You were never going to get it right. Yes, I was. I was just starting to think. I was thinking, maybe it's locked. No. Yes. No, no. Yes, Infinity. The Step of Dreams. Its magic is legendary. Its force can be lethal. Now only one young hero can use its power to save the world. is back. Faster, braver, stronger. Tag 2, The Staff of Dreams, the video game, in stores this October. Cool. You did it! Good going, guy! It's all over now. It's been a long and arduous journey, full of hardship and self-sacrifice. But we did it! Now we need merely to return the Staff of Dreams to the Dream Guardian and go home! Before we go, aren't you going to introduce us to your buddy there? Who? What buddy? Your hand buddy. Hand buddy? Sorry about that whole beating you up thing earlier. <laughs> oh. Your quest is over, Tack. I'm proud of you. Couldn't have done it much better myself. Time to party! You were vanquished! I now know that I can never defeat you. For you truly are the great and mighty warrior of the Pupununu people's prophecy. So, if you can't defeat me, and I've stopped you from taking over the world, then why am I here? I cannot defeat you directly, Tak. But now, I see another way. I know your weakness, Tak. I know your greatest fear. Do you? Indeed. 
You are weak because you care for your pathetic friends. But once they are destroyed, you no longer have any reason to fight. Tlaylock, you truly are my worst nightmare. Hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. Wake up, Tech! Wake up! You've been asleep for too long! Uh, is it over? Am I still in the dream world? Tech, you've been asleep for 16 days. I think you've been in the dream world long enough. Not long enough to hook the lock up with that princess you kept mumbling about. When are you planning on taking your next nap anyways? But was it all just a dream? It seems so real, Jaboba. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Why don't you tell us all about it on the way back to the village? It was very weird. There were nightmare creatures everywhere. Oh, and Tlaylock was at the head of an army of evil sheep. Evil sheep! <laughs> Wake up, Tack! Wake up! 
You've been asleep for too long. Come on, Tack. Snap out of it. He's been like this for days. I've tried everything. I'm at my wit's end, Locke. Oh, creepy. His eyes are open, but he's still snoozing. So, the great and mighty warrior of the Poopanunu people is taking the world's longest nappy. Well, if he's tired, I can take over being great and mighty, mighty and great. Great, great. Mighty, mighty, mighty. Great, great, mighty, mighty. <laughs> great, great. <sighs> mighty. I need helpful ideas, Locke, about waking Tack up. Right. Right. Hmm. Gotcha. Hey, you! Wakey, wakey! Good morning, sunshine! Rise and shine! Open up those eyes of yours, sleepy head! Stop it, Luck. I've already tried that. Okay, plan beta. You grab their nose, they can't breathe, they wake up real fast. Luck, I think. I think he's turning blue! No, Tax always looked a little blue. Not that blue! Oh, he's got drool coming out of his mouth. What's wrong with him, anyhow, Jabalba? I don't know. But he's been talking out loud in his sleep. I think Tack has been having the same dream over and over. And in this dream, he finds himself in a strange world. Ah, good! It's you again! Of course you must remember me. I am Jabulba, the great and powerful shaman of the Pupanunu people. It has been some time since we last met, and I know that you juju spirits can be forgetful. I, however, have an excellent memory, so let me remind you of what has gone before. Just let me find my notes. <clears throat> uh, chicken feet, uh, juju bubbles, I have juju. Ah, yes, here we are. Last year, in the 14th cycle of the Leaping Weasel, the Pupanunu people's prophecy came to pass. The evil shaman Tleilak stole the sacred moonstones. The beautiful moon Juju, who watches over our people, was rendered powerless. Tleilak then turned all the villagers into sheep. Only a handful of us escaped his vile plan. For a time, I thought that the warrior Locke was destined to be the hero who would defeat Tleilak and save the Pupununu people. But instead, I came to learn that a true hero is made of more than just muscles. Tack, my lowly apprentice, took up the task, restored the moonstones, and saved us all. Tack faced the evil shaman Tleilak, defeated him in combat, and then left him trapped in the body of a sheep. Poetic justice, I would say. And so we were saved by the most unlikely of heroes. But even though Tack has learned much and grown stronger since that time, I sense that not all is well. Sometimes, Tack falls into a deep sleep from which we cannot awaken him. I do not know what this means, but I'm sure that a wise juju such as yourself can help. You can help us, can't you? Good work, Tack. Now we can restore the staff and return it to its rightful owner. Okay, everybody, you might want to take cover. Prince Locke is here to free his beautiful princess. Yeah! Locke, there is no princess. <laughs> Don't fool yourself. Of course there is. Why else would we come all this way? Well, I guess it's up to me to rescue her and perhaps take her as my bride. Oh, 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 oh! Me too! Me too! Me too! Did somebody drop this cool stick? May I have that, please? Sure. No! No! <laughs> <laughs> Fools! Now I am the master of nightmares. All the world will know and fear the great shaman, Playlock. <laughs> Tech, you must recover the staff. But how will you defend yourselves against these creatures? 
You must stop Tlaylock. Go! Don't worry. Locke and I can deal with them. Uh, yeah. Get that staff! Don't do it, Locke! It's too strong! <sighs> we might lose him! Come on, Jabalba! A little bit of juju smelling salts never hurt anybody. <laughs> It's working, Jabalba. He's waking up. Dude, you smell himself. Do it every time. I remember back when I was wrestling. What's wrong with you people? I'm trying to take a little nap here. Tech, you've been asleep for 16 days. So? Does that mean crazy people can come and shove their moist, stinking pit in my face? Yep, sure does. And that's not all. I've been sleeping for 16 days? You were dreaming. You kept talking about a princess. Princess? <laughs> What princess? That's right! I'm supposed to rescue some princess. She's trapped in the dream world, but how can I do that, Jaboba? Hmm. Well, we'll have to go see my brother, JB. He's an expert in the world of dreams. Oh, well, we better get going. Wouldn't want anybody else to rescue that princess. <sighs> Let me guess. You're thinking King Locke, right? Hey, I'm not greedy. I like Prince Locke, too, especially if she's a looker. Uh, Locke, there's no way, uh, how can I put this? Uh, Locke, would you help out the wise and powerful shaman of the Pupununu people by going back to my hut and, uh, uh fetching my other pair of sandals? Uh, I have a very painful bunion. Dogs fetch shoes, Jabalba. Prince Locke's fetch princesses. Ah, but uh, these are the sacred sandals, the most powerful open-toed shoes in the history of magical footwear. Really? Ooh, I'll need those. You go on ahead, I'll catch up. But, Jaboba, you don't have any sacred sandals. Maybe Locke will find me a pair. They sound fantastic. In the meantime... Jaboba? Down here! Yeah, what are you doing? Just hitching a ride. Now, let's head off for my brothers before Locke gets back. Ow! That was my shin bone, baby! That doesn't sound like Locke. Hey, not again! You guys are killing my festive feeling! Party poopers, leave me alone! We'll need this Juju's help to get out of the swamp, Tack. Okay, everybody, back away from the Tiki. You, yeah, you, move along, little wooden guy. You're gonna get thwarted. No, no, no! And don't let the number munch can take my Tiki! Go after him and get it, baby! Go, go, go! Flora, Fauna, what are you doing here? The Moon Juju asked us to help you, Tack. Fauna and I are here to grant you the power to transform into an animal. Oh, great! I could really use that! You can either become a big, nasty bear or a happy little squirrel. Now, there's no pressure to choose either one, although the squirrel is very good. Take your time and think about it so uh, you can... forget that! Of course he wants to be a bear. Bears are big, hairy butt kickers. But if Tack is that big, they'll see him coming from miles away. I think he'd prefer to be a squirrel. Well, I think he'd prefer to be a bear. Hey, squirrel! Bear! Turn it out! Squirrel! Bear! Squirrel! Good enough. I really gotta run now. Bye! Anyway, it looks like you'll be able to transform into either a bear or a squirrel. All you need to do is be near an animal totem that looks like the animal you want to become, and then press the X button. Remember, you burn mana while you're in animal form, so plan ahead. Good luck, Tack. Flora, I need your help. Are there any more animals I could change into? Certainly, Tack. I can give you the choice of two more animals. Your first choice is a frog. They're kind of yucky. 
but they've got really long tongues, so you'll probably be able to swing on things. Also, you'll be able to swim really fast to avoid nasty things like gators. Plus, they're green. I like green. Well, because I look good. The other animal you can become is a boar. They're dirty, stinky pigs who are right at home in the mud. You'll be able to break stuff and charge enemies. If it's what you like to do, then knock it off, Fauna! Can't you see I am trying to help Tack with his quest? Help him! You can turn into a froggy cat. Ooh, I look good in green, Tack. You're not helping him! More like boring him. Oh, so I'm just a big boar now, am I? Yep, pretty much. So, who's the boar now? Anyway, choose whichever one you want. Let's get a move on, Tack! What happened to us? I think someone's trying to keep us You're from reaching my brother. <laughs> Should we wake them up? We could, if we want to have a couple of babbling blockheads following us around. They're tired. They need their sleep. I like your way of thinking, Tack. Let's go. There's GB's house! We're almost there, at last! It's beautiful, isn't it? Just like I knew it would be. He must really be a wonderful shaman to live in a crib like that! Ah, he's nothing special. Let's go! Sleep. Sleep. Sleep? Who's sleepy? Not me. Hmm. <sighs> Ooh, these flowers smell pretty. The flowers, we've got to fight it. Wake up, uh, it's... Sleep, sleep. 